What's up everybody, this is Danny, and today I've partnered with Amazon to show you the easiest Wi-Fi mesh system that I've ever used. There are two new powerful and affordable Eero solutions for your ultimate smart home, and no longer do you have to pay a premium price to get the power of Wi-Fi 6 and 6E in your home. If you want something that's hassle-free and just works, then stick around because this is the literal definition of easy. Before we get started, let's talk about my home and how you can pick between the Eero 6 Plus and the Eero Pro 6E. I have tons of devices connected to my network and I admit it's a little bit overkill because we have everything from the smart kitchen to a teched out home gym. My home office is also fully connected with multiple computers. I do everything from editing videos to some casual PC gaming and we stream 4K content a lot as a family watching our favorite TV shows and movies and the kids do a lot of educational work on their tablets. Not necessarily is the more expensive version the better version, it all depends on your needs. Even with all of this stuff connected in my house, I chose the more affordable dual band Eero 6 Plus because it covers the right amount of square footage and I don't have faster than gigabit speeds from my internet provider. But if you are lucky enough to have multi gigabit speeds in your area and need the extra power of the tri-band Eero 6E, then go for that one because it does cover more area and it supports the newer six gigahertz band Think about dual band as a two lane highway. You have 2.4 gigahertz and five gigahertz. And with tri-band, now you have that third lane highway with six gigahertz and you can connect up to 100 devices simultaneously. But why spend the extra money if you don't need to? Most people don't connect that many devices. So for most homes, including my own, the Eero 6 Plus will definitely do the job with up to 75 devices connected at the same time. Here's what you will get if you pick one of these up. I have the three pack, but it's available in a single pack, which covers up to 1500 square feet at just $139. A two pack, which covers up to 3000 square feet at $239. And the three pack that you see here is $299, which covers up to 4,500 square feet. So that is a great value. You get everything that you need in the box. In the three pack, you get three power supplies and three Eero devices. The six plus design is very compact and leaving it out in the open won't be a big deal because it blends in nicely with modern homes. And you also get one ethernet cord to plug into your modem. To set it up, all it takes is this. Just plug any one of these into your modem with the ethernet cord. The great thing about the six plus system is you don't have to worry about which one is going to be the gateway. There is no guesswork any one of these will do. Download the Eero app on Android or iOS. And then if you have an Amazon account, sign in because that will make setup so much easier and it will give you smart home hub functionality, which I will show you later. Literally the app steps you through the entire process. You give Bluetooth access so it can find your Eero device. Tell the app where it's going to be so it's easy to keep up with the devices in the app. You can even give it a custom name. I have a network closet downstairs, so I will name it that. Super easy to do. Then you set your network name and password of your choice. Then that's literally it. The setup was about a minute or so for me. I was so surprised. Funny story about the setup is that I had to record it twice because it was so fast the first time I couldn't capture it on camera. So trust me when I say this is the easiest setup on any Wi-Fi mesh network. Adding the additional bases are also just as easy. It even gives you guides where to place them for the best coverage is best to place them out in the open and away from big electronics that could interfere with Wi-Fi signals. Once you plug it in, the app just starts looking for it. Then you just name it so you can keep track of it again and you don't have to do anything. It just tells you it's ready. It can't be any easier. And one more thing, this is a big one. If you already own Eero devices, then it's fully backwards compatible. So you can just add on as your smart home expands and you can just swap out your existing gateway to a newer one. So you don't have to tear down your whole mesh system and start all over again. So I've had this set up for about a week now and here are the speeds. I have a Git connection that's a little bit inconsistent because they decided to choose my house for a hub to split off for the rest of the neighborhood. So speeds aren't what they used to be but this is super respectable off of this system. Look at that ping. The latency is fantastic. Five milliseconds off of Wi-Fi, and I'm getting about three to four milliseconds on ethernet. So this is incredible. Of course, the farther you go away from the gateway, things slow down a little bit, but I'm upstairs and look at the ping and the speed. It's quite impressive at this price range. I've been really enjoying the speeds. It's been really consistent so far and it's eliminated every dead spot that's in my house. And I have a two story home right around 3000 square feet. High resolution streaming is almost instant with services like Netflix 
and it works great with 4K content from Prime Video. My last mesh network got sluggish over time, so I'll definitely follow up with this one to see if that happens. But I was not getting this type of speed and consistency from it, and it was a much more expensive mesh router system, so I think that you'll really be impressed with this one. What makes this an amazing mesh system for smart homes is that it acts as a Zigbee hub. So you can connect multiple smart home devices on your network with Alexa, like this Philips Hue smart bulb. You don't need to buy a Hue hub at all because your Eero will take the place of that. Go over to the Discover tab and then hit Amazon Connected Home and then click on Smart Home Hub and Discover Zigbee Devices and just link your Alexa app and go to the type of device. So here we'll pick Light then find the manufacturer, because this is Philips Hue, there it is, and just hit discover. And then within a few seconds, you will just see the magic happen. The bulb will start flashing. And just like that, it's connected to the network with no hassle. When you buy Amazon frustration-free smart home devices like the new Fire TV, it automatically joins the network and stays connected on that network even if you change your network name or password since it's linked to your Amazon account. This is just way too easy. And fans of smart home will be happy to know that it acts as a thread border router, so it will give you interoperability with certified Matter devices in the future. Now, if you want to build your smart home on thread, you don't have to buy an Apple TV 4K or a HomePod mini. This has you covered. The Eero app is also something that you'll appreciate. It's really easy to use and everything is laid out in four tabs, the home, activity, discover, and settings. Home is where you will see all your connected devices. If you click on the device, you will see all of the details. It usually does a good job of auto listing the devices, but if you need to, you can change it. You can see Tizen on here, but that is my Samsung Family Hub fridge, so I can change it to that. The activity tab is where you can see all your downloaded and uploaded data and also shows you the security with Eero Secure Plus, which you get free for 30 days, show scans and block threats in an easy view. The Discover tab is where all your Eero Secure features live. At $2.99 per month or $29.99 per year, you get a good amount of security features such as block threats. You get a built-in ad blocker and filter levels for profiles. So for my son, I can come in and pick the age-appropriate filters to block adult content and other things that I don't want him to have access to. If you choose the $9.99 a month or $99 per year option, you get all of that. And you also get malware scanning, a VPN, remote network access, and also 1Password as a password manager. So that's a good deal for all those services bundled together. The parental controls are really important for my family, so I'm glad that all this is built into the Aero 6 devices. I showed you the content filters already, but I can block certain apps as well, which is nice. Just like when I was a kid, sometimes you gotta take away those video games, so it's nice to be able to block Roblox and Nintendo games with just a touch, so that's a nice feature. And if your child is on a certain website too much or something is new that isn't on this list, you can add a block site right here. So it's a robust solution that you might appreciate if you have a growing family at different ages because you can make separate profiles for different children and customize accordingly. While I need to use this a little bit more for a follow-up video down the line, my first impressions, it's been solid so far after a week. There are new features being added all the time like WPA3 support and software updates are frequent to keep your network secure. The Aero 6 Plus is by far the easiest Wi-Fi mesh network that I've ever used, and it's competitively priced at $299 for the 3-pack, so if this is something that you need, it's definitely worth looking into. Even if you need the tri-band power of the Aero Pro 6e, the 2-pack for multi-gigabit speeds is $499, which is cheaper than I thought it would be, and if you want something even more affordable, the last-gen Aero 6 is still very capable and gets a nice price cut for $89 for a 1-pack, $139 for a 2-pack, and $199 for the 3-pack, so I'll leave everything linked down below so you can check current pricing. All great Wi-Fi mesh solutions, it's easy to use, it's powerful, and most importantly, affordable, so it's a win all across the board, but I think the Eero 6 Plus is the sweet spot and it's my recommendation for the ultimate smart home. Thanks for watching and subscribe for a lot more smart home videos like this and hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I will see you guys in the next one.